Hi scientists, I'm Sean. And I'm Julia. And we're back with another demo of the week. Today we're going to be demonstrating the difference between paramagnetic materials and diamagnetic materials with the paramagnetic oxygen demo. Julia, what's the difference between paramagnetic materials and diamagnetic materials? Paramagnetics have at least one unpaired electron in their molecular orbital and they are attracted to the magnetic field. While diamagnetics have all paired electrons in their molecular orbitals, so they are repelled by magnetic field. Let's see the difference between our diamagnetic liquid nitrogen and our paramagnetic liquid oxygen. These are both gases at room temperature, so we had to cool them down to extremely low temperatures to get them into their liquid states. As you can see, the liquid nitrogen flows over the magnet and evaporates. This is because it's a diamagnetic species and is propelled by the magnetic field. Now let's see what happens when we pour the paramagnetic liquid oxygen over the magnet. Now as you can see, the magnet is actually attracting the paramagnetic oxygen. It's because paramagnetic materials are attracted to magnets and they induce an attractive dipole force. So now you know the difference between paramagnetics and diamagnetics. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you next week for another Demo of the Week.